Hey everybody, it's Margaret with Main Street Hair Solutions. I know it's easy for me to assume that you know how to put on a wig, but I do remember when I used to not know how to put on a wig, and I thought that I would make a very quick video today to show how to do it. And part of it is about physically, you know, how to put, how to get the wig on your head. But then the other part of it is just how to position it so that it fits and looks right. So there's a difference there between having a wig on your head and having it look good on your head. So um, I've got my own wig that I wear all the time with me. And so I need to back up in order for you to see how I do it. But basically I just dip my head right into the cap. So I'm gonna stand back here so you can watch. I do have a lace front on the wig, by the way. And so I need to make sure that I get that laying flat on my forehead and not folded under. So Okay. So the first thing that I did was I put it on low just to make sure it's flat and got it tucked at the nape of my neck. Then I grabbed the ear tabs that are right here on both sides and that's used to turn the wig. Okay, and then the last thing, I actually want to leave it in the wrong position. So this is not right. This wig needs to go back further. I look ridiculous. I'm not even looking in a mirror, but I can feel that I look ridiculous. So my hairline is back here and this looks really silly. Another thing is if you don't have these on right, it's just, it doesn't look right. So you get it on. You get those ear tabs adjusted from side to side so that it's centered on your head. And then the last thing you do is pull the hair back. I'm not even looking in a mirror, but that feels right to me. That feels like where I normally wear it. So this looks good, but if I pull it down here, doesn't that look kind of silly? And it's going to continue looking silly even as I pull it up. It just doesn't look right until you've really got it for where your hairline is and what looks natural on your face. And so for me, this is where it needs to be. At least I think it is. I'm just going by feel because I'm not looking in a mirror, but that feels right to me. And so that's how you put on a wig. And if it's too low on your forehead, it's too far back on your forehead, again, I can do this too. That looks that also looks kind of silly and in fact it probably will fall off my head because it's not right. That looks silly. So now I'm just going to take it off. But that's how you put on a wig. This is Margaret at Main Street Hair Solutions in Thorpe, Wisconsin. If you have any questions, give me a shout out. Thanks. Bye.